Guys, it's your favorite hot mess here. Um, <clears throat> sorry I don't look presentable in this video, um, but I wanted to record this video because two years ago when I talked about my urinary issues that I have with urinary tract infections, um, I got a lot of responses and a lot of women saying, you know, they've had this issue too, and if I find anything out, please let them know. Um, because they want more information on it, and I have been looking for two years now on more information because my urinary tract infection symptoms have gotten worse and worse and worse to the point where I'm literally walking around every single day almost feeling like a needle is like stabbing at me in my urinary tract, um, feeling like I'm on the brink of an infection. So I went to the urologist but not the urologist in Oshkosh because if you don't know um Wisconsin Institute of Urology has an Oshkosh location and they also have a Nina location I ended up going to the Nina location um and I got a lot more answers than I did at the Oshkosh location so I have a few supplements in front of me today that you can't see at the moment that I'll talk to you guys about. But first, I want to tell you guys, I found out that a lot of my symptoms aren't actually from urinary tract infections. I have something called interstitial cystitis. Basically, what that is, is it's your bladder being very sensitive to acidic foods and sugary foods and things like that. So, when I would have my morning coffee, I would feel like I was on the brink of having a urinary tract infection and um, things like that. I noticed it a lot with coffee, um, a lot with sugary things, so I pretty much cut soda out of my diet completely for the longest time, and I pretty much have stuck to that, just personal preference, um, but it got to the point where I was drinking a lot of water, like I have a 36 ounce Yeti um, water bottle and I was drinking like that entire thing two times a day which is not bad for you because you're supposed to have a lot of water every day but it was just getting so intense and the water wasn't helping so I did find products that worked for me and um, I do have like a pan or whatever you want to call it but I'll do of these first few products that I'm gonna mention um, so I found these a while ago, probably I want to say six months to a year ago by now, and I found it most effective for me to order the entire complete package. Um, so what I am talking about here is Eucora. So um, honestly, they should sponsor me because I've spent so much money with them, it's not even funny. But um, basically, so I'll break this down for what each one of these supplements are. Um, so you kind of understand what they do because it took a lot of like me looking into it and researching things to find out exactly what they do. And they do a lot better of a job now like actually supplying that information on their website than they did when I first started purchasing it. So this is called Target. It's basically these little packets um, that you take, you know, with water and it tells you how much to put in there. It tastes like pink lemonade um, and you do it every three days if you don't know what's causing your urinary tract infections. Otherwise, you also help, you, you know, how people say, you know, after you're intimate or you have sex you're supposed to pee while well, after you're intimate and you have sex you're supposed to pee and drink one of these um it helps flush out your urinary tract so that you don't get any leftover bacteria in there causing you to get an infection um and you just take one packet and you mix it with 8 to 12 ounces of water um it's immune boosting it's antibiotic free and it's allergen free gluten free and vegan um which is really nice because a lot of what a lot of people don't know is the supplements that they give you at the doctor's office to cure your urinary tract infection can actually it basically takes every single bacteria in your urinary tract and it wipes it out so even the good bacteria is getting wiped out as well so this is to health, healthily, a more healthy way to clean out your urinary tract. 
um, this next product that's by Eucora. This is called Control, and it has on the front that it cleanses biofilm. Now, what biofilm is, is it's this film that will grow around the bacteria that is sitting in your bladder or in your urinary tract, and it'll prevent your antibiotics from breaking through and actually getting rid of that bacteria. So what this does is you take two capsules a day and it makes sure that any bacteria that is within your urinary tract basically gets flushed out and it gets broken down. So I take two capsules per day. There is 60 capsules in one bottle and these are also vegan capsules. Um, if you look on the back, it's got things like vitamin D3, d manos, green tea extract, turmeric extract, black pepper powder, things like that. So it's nothing that is antibiotics. So it's actually more healthy for you to take something like this every day than to take antibiotics every few months or every few weeks because you feel like you're getting a urinary tract infection. So, um, the next product that I'm going to talk about is, this is called Promote, and this actually balances your vaginal mi microbiome. Um, this is a dietary supplement. There's 30 vegan capsules in here, and you take one per day. Per day. Sorry, I can't talk. Um, but you take one per day. So, basically, it balances your pH, like your vaginal pH, to make sure that that bacteria is not getting anywhere else to make sure that your vaginal pH is healthy which also helps your urinary tract to make sure that bacteria that's not wanted isn't getting in there. So um, these three per day is, well not per day, but these three are what I take. I take these two every day and then I do this usually every three days or every week or so depending on what I feel I need because I can kind of tell now when my body needs it. So these have been extremely helpful and um, they're a lot healthier than taking, um, what should we call it, antibiotics and they are also immune boosters. So that helps especially with COVID going on right now. Um, the next few products that I'm going to talk about I have found with the help of my grandma. Um, my grandma does a lot of just natural um healing like not like not like natural healing like herbs and stuff like that just like she drinks a lot of tea she does a lot of research on organically what will help you stay healthy as a person um things like that so her one of her friends has urinary tract problems and they knew that I had urinary tract problems since I was four years old. So what they gave to me is it's called D Manos Pure Powder. It's for a healthy urinary tract. It's certified organic. Um, I believe they have different brands other than this brand, but this is by the brand now. Um, basically what it is is you take like a scoop of this or so. It just looks like white powder in there. Um, and basically it tastes sweet. It's almost like a sugar, but basically what it does is it cleanses your bladder kind of like this does. It's supposed to flush it out. And what's actually really funny about this is I didn't even realize, but this is also in the control as well. So I haven't been taking this as often just because I'm getting that in my control. But um, this does help taking it. It's like take one level teaspoon one to two times daily with water or unsweetened juice, such as unsweetened cranberry juice. So um, this helps as well if you wanted to take a route more like that. Um, I also take these every day, which she supplied for me. It's natural cranberry extract. Um, so you take one of these per day. The pills are actually pretty big. Um, it's basically like cranberry in a powdered form. So they're pretty big. You take one of them per day. Um, and cranberry supplements are also immune boosters. This one is by the brand Puritan's Pride. But I have used other ones before as well. I just like using this one because most of them you have to take two per day. And I like just taking one per day since I'm already taking two of these per day. One of these per day. And then I take one of these. 
So I like this and they're not as big as like um, the nature's made ones that I had previous which those ones were big they were like horse pills and you took two of them so I like taking these a lot better um, they seem to be working a lot better for me as well and then the next product I'm going to talk about um, my doctor actually referred me to which has changed my life it has helped me so much knock on wood I have not had any symptoms no feeling like I'm getting stabbed, no nothing like that. So, um, yeah. Okay, so this next product that I'm going to talk about, it's actually called Preleaf. You can get it on Amazon. She gave me my first pack as like a trial, um, and that had 12 pills on it, but I got this on Amazon. This has 120 of them for $11, so it is not that bad at all. Um, this is also natural, so basically all it has in it is calcium glycerphosphate and magnesium stearate. So basically what it does is you take two of these. I usually take them at the beginning of the day because I usually notice that like I don't need to take multiple a day, but some people may need to. There's no way that you can overdose on these, I already asked. Um, so basically what you do is you take two of these a day, or that's what I do because that's what helps me. Um, I take two of these usually before I drink like coffee in the morning, but basically what it does is the ingredients in here coats your bladder and your urinary tract. So if you do have something acidic, it actually breaks down the acidity in half. So like with coffee and wine and actually um, when I was looking up stuff on <sighs> interstitial cystitis, yeah. I like can never think of like say it right unless I think about it beforehand but when I was looking up stuff on that condition I used to say to my parents when I was little cranberry juice isn't helping it isn't helping it isn't helping it's making it worse it isn't helping well come to find out on the interstitial cystitis packet that she gave me that is actually one of the trigger food or drinks for your bladder when you have interstitial cystitis so, like, if you've ever taken cranberry juice and you're like, it's not helping, it's not helping, I don't know why it's not helping, well, you could have interstitial cystitis, which there's not necessarily a way that they can diagnose it. They just kind of have you journal what is irritating your bladder and things like that. And um, you kind of find out by doing it that way. Uh, but basically, I take two of these a day usually, which I actually haven't taken any today. So sometimes, like, the coating of the bladder, for me, will last over a day, which is kind of nice. Um, and I don't have to take them every day. But they, they're they really small. They look like this. Um, they're white. You take two of them, like, per... You're supposed to take two of them per meal or, like, every time that you're drinking or eating something that um, can be acidic. So for me, you can do it like in the middle of like when you're eating or drinking that thing. But for me, what helps is actually taking it before I even have coffee in the morning. So I'll literally just like drink water and I'll take that. And then I'm completely fine. So it works. It really does work. Um, and I haven't found a lot of things that work for me, but this stuff right in front of me has worked very very well um and this is something that i have been wondering and trying to cure i guess about myself since i was four years old and it got worse when i became an adult um we don't really know why we do know that interstitial cystitis does run on my mom's side of the family so that could be part of it as well but i found out that it is common um, for women to have this and the only reason that they said they thought I had interstitial cystitis is because when you go to the doctor they generally have you pee in a cup and when you go to the urologist they don't have you pee in a cup no they actually have you lay on a table they insert a catheter into you they do what's called a clean catch with your urine and then after they're done doing the clean catch they test your urine and then that way none of your skin cells or anything else from around that area can get into the urine so that they actually have a clean sample. So I have had E. coli, staph B, or staph B, wow, E. coli, staph, strep B, um, 
and a few other bacterias too. E. coli is normal for when you have a urinary tract infection. Um, staph and strep B are actually bacteria that are known to be within the vaginal realm. So what they're thinking is that I didn't have a urinary tract infection and I was just starting one or something along those lines and yeah. So I've taken a lot of antibiotics in my life. I can almost name them, which is scary because they have very long names. That's how often I've taken them. Um, and I can usually tell you what the cost is for them too. Um, but that's also, you know, with my insurance. So all of these products I have found to work for me. Um, the Eucora, like I said, I have found that the full system works the best for me. So that means these two and this together, you can buy them individually. It is less expensive if you subscribe to the, you know, full subscription or say I can change my subscription every month. So like I sometimes I'll just get these two because I have enough of this or I'll just get this because I have enough of these two or I'll just get this and this. Like you can change it however you want to. Um, another thing that's really helped me is Eucora has just come out with these pH balanced wipes. That also helps me um, when I feel like I am going to get an infection or something along those lines. But guys, I am telling you, since I have gone to urology like two weeks ago, no, a week ago, I haven't had any symptoms, which is crazy for me. And that's when I got this. And I've been taking these for a while, but these, just so you guys know, these do not work unless you take them every day. Okay, so that was one mistake that I made when I first started on these, is these did not work unless I took them every single day. It can get kind of pricey. My whole system all together with these three, um, with the subscription, is about $52. But you know what? $52 versus $200 for a doctor's visit. So I call it a win for me. Um, but yeah. I want people to know about this because it is a really serious issue um, with women and a lot of times some doctors really don't care to find out what the actual issue is and they just want to get you out of the office and that was the case with me for a very 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 long time and it got very emotionally draining and physically draining because your body is like um, physically drained from having an infection and being in pain and stuff like that and um so <clears throat> these really do work I'm like I'm sitting here and telling you guys about this because I want to help other people that had the same problem that I do sometimes or do all the time or used to all the time because it's not fun you literally like I get to the point where like if I have an infection I sit there and I'm literally sitting there and like it's burning not even when I'm urinating like it's literally burning just with me sitting there so it's painful and it's hard to work through sometimes but this stuff all of this stuff not even just taking it together just all of this stuff that I have mentioned it works and um I want you guys to know about this so that if you need the same help that I did, you can get it. Like, it is right in front of you. You can get this stuff. You can order it online. Um, Eucora has to be ordered online. You can't get it in store. But you can buy it in store. You can buy this in store. You can buy this in store and this in store. Like, this is stuff that is readily available to you. And I'm giving you this information because I care. So, um... Let me know if you guys have any questions. I can give you links to things, whatever you need. Um, but I want other women and other people who have issues with this to have the resources that they need. Because I had to go searching for this for years and years and years. And I just found answers. And I'm now 21 years old and I've been dealing with this since I was four. So I want you guys to be able to have this information. I want you guys to be able to ask me things and you know see if I have the answers because I've been on this journey for a very 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 long time 
and um, we've never been able to pinpoint what triggers these symptoms, but now I got it. <laughs> so I hope you guys like this video. If you do like it, please give it a big thumbs up. Um, Eucora, you should probably sponsor me at some point because, girl, it is such a good product. I love your stuff. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. I'm sorry I've been so absent. This is the busiest semester I've ever had, and it is actually a shorter semester because I have spring break in the middle of my semester. But... I love you guys, and please let me know if you have any further questions. I'd be happy to answer them for you if I can, or for you to somebody who can help you. Um, and I hope you guys have a great rest of your day. Happy spring! Happy Easter! Like, what the heck? It's already around the corner, and we just got through 2020. I feel like it's still 2020, but it's 2021. So, alright, I love you guys. Have a good rest of your day.